Hi everyone, it's Avery Dawnside and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my morning routine for the summertime. I'm going to be quite honest, we don't have a set routine for every single day, especially since we moved. Every day looks a little different at the barn, but for now I'm going to show you what our morning routine is now. So let's get into it. Good morning everyone. I am currently standing outside of my house that I just closed the deal on. You can see that on my Instagram at Avery Dawnside SSO. But anyways, I usually get up and out the door by 7.30 and then I head over to the cafe to get a bite to eat before heading over to the barn. Since I moved into the Cape West Fishing Village, I've been coming to the Red Shark Cafe every morning to grab a quick bite to eat before heading over to the barn. The people here are so nice and I love the food. My usual go-to is a cinnamon roll and a cup of tea, which yes, it isn't the healthiest, but it makes me feel super energized in the morning because of the sugar and just makes me feel warm inside because of the tea. So yeah. Now that I finish up with my food, I am going to head out and walk across the bridge to the barn. So if you guys didn't know, my barn is actually located on a small island connected to the island that I live on, which holds the Cape West Fishing Village. So I just walk across the very long boardwalk, which is a super nice view, but it's kind of windy until I get over to Golden Leaf Stables, which is my new home stable. So the first place I go once I get on the island is the pasture to go ahead and feed all my 10 horses. If you guys didn't check out my last video, I will be linking it in the iCard right now so that you guys can go and meet all the horses that I have in my barn. But I like to feed them before I get started on any of my work in the stables just so that they have time to digest. And the horse that I'm riding today is Chestnut, so there he is, the pretty boy. While all of the horses are eating, I go ahead and check the board to see what I have to do today. Today my job was just to muck out all of the stalls and now you can see that they're all very pretty for all of the riders that are coming in throughout the day. Tessa actually bit the camera while I was brushing him so I'm just calming him down and picking out his hooves before I go ahead and get started on tacking him up for our ride today. Now that Chestnut is all tacked up, I went ahead and put on my helmet as well as my gloves and that means that we are all set and ready to go for our first ride for the morning. Just a disclaimer, in this video I am not wearing my tall boots because they got wet last night in the rain and they are currently in the barn drying. <laughs> Just a little time check, it is around 9 a.m. now, so it's starting to get a little bit warmer, but you're gonna notice in this video I am walking Chessy. That is his nickname, I forgot to mention that. But I'm walking Chestnut around the arena a little bit extra than I normally would, just because it's the morning time and I wanna get him up and get his energy higher, but also because Golden Leaf Arena is a new arena to us and he developed this habit where he likes to rub against the jumps to itch his body. So I'm trying to get him out of that. <laughs> After walking for a while, I went ahead and got Chestnut trotting. He did seem a little bit on the slow side today, which could be from the fact that it is morning time, but I am also currently in the process of getting Chestnut back into a working schedule, so he hasn't been ridden super consistently for quite a few months, but now that we're trying to get back into a routine, he is feeling a little bit sore I think from the past few rides. trotting around for a bit he got a little more forward I think because he was starting to wake up more so I went ahead and started cantering him quite soon after just so that he could release some of that new energy. Once 
once we finish cantering, I go ahead and get him trotting over some small jumps. We're used to jumping a lot higher than this, so this was an adjustment, but I'm also lowering the height just because we're in a new environment, like I said before, and I don't want him to get spooked at anything or try and rub his back against any of the jumps like I was saying he does. jumping I wanted to give him the opportunity to explore the area more and get him more comfortable with his new surroundings so I went ahead and went on a small hack as our cooldown and he was really interested in the water and all of the wind connected with living on an island so I think that really gave him some excitement but he was also really chill and didn't buck me off or anything so that is super great. So I'm just going ahead and getting Chessy untacked. I am super proud of how he behaved today, especially in a new environment and being the first horse that I've ridden since moving to Golden Leaf in the new arena. So I'm getting him untacked before taking him back out into the pasture so he can go roll in the grass and play with his friends. So that concludes our morning routine for today. As I was saying earlier, every day is different. Some are short and sweet while others are super long. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and follow us on Instagram at AveryDawnSideSSO for more updates. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!